What is going on guys? My name is Coaster Plant here and today I will be making a video about a teaser. But before we do that, I got to I got to tell you guys that someone just commented on my last video similar to this one saying that they can't hear my voice. So here it is guys you probably can hear me now so without further ado let's get down to business and speculate what rides could be coming next year so i caught this teaser on social media on instagram and i don't have an instagram account about i mean instagram account about coaster planet it's just my own account, my personal account. So I just caught this and was like, "Yeah, next year will be a better year. I mean, will be the good, will be the great year." Because last year, what Six Flags added wasn't really exciting and wasn't really that great of a dish, of a of a year. So I think for 2018 would be a lot better. So what rides could they possibly add? So, we're going to speculate right now. So, B&M Giga. I know this would break a few records, but this is way too expensive. And I doubt Six Flags will build in a B&M Giga because they're really expensive and they don't want to use that budget. Because remember... What they did after they built Tatsu, they don't want to build a mega coaster that's really expensive. Although, it's been rumored that Magic Mountain may get a B&M dive coaster next year. Maybe it will be the world's tallest dive coaster. Maybe, maybe more inversions on a dive coaster. So, yeah. It will probably break Valerie Vin's record. So, this will be also great. Or we can see a skyscraper over 500 feet tall, feet in the air. Oh my gosh. But, we're not sure what's going to be themed to. It could be theme to a DC hero or something we haven't heard of maybe they will trademark a different name that we haven't heard before or we don't know so we'll have to wait and see another thing remember my last video guys I was talking about a polar coaster coming to a Six Flags Park is this possible guys I think it is but it's also been it's also been planned for Florida but really really haven't heard much about this polar coaster going to Florida so I'm not sure if it's going to be built or maybe it will take about it will take a few years before they open this and start construction because they have to do some blueprints and they have to agree with this so yeah I heard that Six Flags Magic Mountain may get an RMC T-Rex but I'm not sure if they would want to add in a roller coaster with RMC the same company they did with Twisted Colossus. So, although this would, this could also break a few records. Maybe put in an RMC T-Rex hypercoaster. Although it would be similar to Goliath at the same park. So, we could see an RMC T-Rex coming. But... I don't know if Six Flags would want to put 
put in an R. I don't think Six Flags would put in another RMC coaster because they would think, you know, they would think that they cheated because they added they're cheating. They want to add in the same coaster, something like that. Not sure, but I just heard that an RMC T-Rex coaster may be coming to Magic Mountain for next year. So, yeah. Another thing that people were ho hoping is that the SNS 40 Free Fly Coaster or Free Spin will have a different layout finally. So, this is probably a different layout and it looks cool. More more awesome. But we just hope that they're not going to clone any more NS SNS 40 Free Fly Coasters because it's really the same ride experience and it's really not getting ex that exciting anymore because they're just the same you just say this you just see the same thing but with a different color scheme sorry if i messed up but not pictured but sns released new concepts for example maybe it will have a, its very first elevator lift at a six flags park so be similar to cannibal so at lagoon so maybe they could add l something like that at six flags i don't think gerslar will will build a your fighter at a six flags park Rex, remember what happened they had a little fight so they're not into gerslar anymore so they're not gonna do that do that like put in a your fighter but I think S and S are still fine with Six Flags, so they could, or they could build build one by Intamin. So I'm not sure. Also, w what would be a cool feature is on the Justice League. What would also what would be a cool feature on a ride is on Justice League Battle for Metropolis. Maybe they could add in virtual reality headsets. Those are uh, new technology, so they could probably do that. So maybe a new feature on a ride with virtual reality. So not sure, but this is just possibility. A lot of guests would probably love that. So moving on, maybe it would also be cool not cool but probably be nice to have an a skyrocket 2 coaster with a different theme that that's also another thing that six flags may add it won't break a record just because it it's not that tall it's only like 150 feet tall something like that 150 feet tall so it's not really that tall of a ride but possibly could theme it to a DC hero or something that we haven't heard before or not heard seen before maybe a well themed ride so that could probably be one of the things that Six Flags are talking about for next year there's a there's uh, for the teaser so yeah or there could be a first ever uh, first ever flat ride that hasn't been released so they can purchase that at a and and put it at a six flags park so i'm trying to say is that first ever flat ride and it really haven't been seen before so a new type new generation so coming to a six flags park we're not sure what's gonna happen but 
anyways guys this is just a speculation on what six flags may be adding next year for the teaser so these are just my guesses not my guesses my predictions so hope you guys enjoyed this video remember guys please comment in the box below on what you what you you what you want to see come to six flags next year anyways guys that will do comment in the box below and subscribe to my channel if you're new if you're new and i'll catch you guys next time bye